ideal in our business when you don't have a union, which I wish you did, and you have nobody to protect your ass or your assets. Uh, you, you, your, your trust is in your boss, your referee, and the guy you're in the ring with. I hope they get 350 million plus out of this. Because yeah. I'll tell you what, as far as I'm concerned, the buck stops with Vince. If his own employees that come and set up the show, plus all the techs, technique, pe technical people that are at those arenas that work for the arena, that night they're under contract with Vince. They are paid, the buck stops here. First thing Vince says, we got a full investigation. I ain't heard diddly do squat about an investigation. Second thing he said on CNN, it could, it could have been Brett's fault. Well, he is oh, not the man to strap himself into oh, that harness. And that's what he said, Owen. He said it could have been Owen's fault. He doesn't strap himself in that, the, te the technicians <clears throat> do. So that's a cold, callous thing. I consider him a crippler on what he did and what he did to uh, draw us for that matter. I mean, Dilo Brown was still very, very, very bad. Dilo's got to be hard, but you don't, you don't try a new move with a guy, a running power ball. That doesn't know what he's doing. First time. And Dilo is still green. And, you know, and, I'm not, I'm not and, blaming and, Dilo, and but he's just do it. Draws is greener, too. God, damn it. You know, I tell you, Owen used to come stay at my house, okay? Because he would take the flights to Calgary and there wasn't a lot of good connections a lot of time. When shows would get canceled or something, come through, stay at my house. And his son, Oge, Owen Jr., was been just getting into hockey. My kids play hockey. I travel hockey, my daughter and my son. And, uh, well, actually, my older boy did too. But, uh, so Owen used to come watch and, the, you know, get, Owen played hockey with his kid too, but he did come watch and see how, he's looking forward to what he's got to look forward to with his kid, his family. And I say, Owen, how in the world do you get up there and do that? He goes, Joe, goes, I hate it. He didn't like this. I tell Vince every time I do not he want to get up there right. and I do not want to get want to get up there and do this. Totally I said, right. Owen, you know, one of these times something's gonna screw up and you're gonna go down. Now, I, I didn't mean to say it. I said, but Owen, you gotta think about that. I, he goes, he goes, I know. He goes, I'm never doing it again. But in in, in our business, you know the way it is, if never you don't never. do it. He's going to get some young fool to jump in your right. shoes, put on a blue suit, and come and do it for you. Right. You know, and then there goes your payday, and you're fired out the door. And Owen just built a big new house. He was going home that next Monday to move into his house. Right. Yeah. And when he did, you know, a couple Sorry, days yeah, it was horrible. It was the most horrible thing. I took my son James up to the funeral, and I was done with the WWE at the time. We weren't working with him. I was still, we were still getting paid for free. Right. And I, you know, I went up there with, I took my son up there. He paid for catering for the whole week. Redid the whole house, resodded the whole property, put in brand new flowers, repainted the house, repainted the inside, did everything over. Thinking that was going to Paid for money. the whole funeral, but I'll tell you what, a tribute to Owen. I've never seen a funeral procession like that in my entire life. Not yeah, even Calvary for a president. Love that family. Not even for a president. President Kennedy's, when I remember as a kid watching, right. was not, nothing. Like a I mean, I didn't remember as a kid watching, but I remember seeing like a cop funeral. Older. It was like a cop funeral. He had, I'm kidding you, I'm not kidding you, at least... I'd say 200 limos, 200 stretches, and then there was two big, huge WWF buses, right? Probably. And then there was cars, a procession, at least they said 10, 15 miles long behind them, and they all went to the funeral, to the plot and everything, man. Yeah. It was on, it was in the funeral home, and it was on loudspeaker outside. There was like a thousand, two thousand people outside listening, and his own was one of the good guys there. He was no, he never would. He never. He wasn't much on drinking. He wasn't. He never messed around on his wife. He was always. Uh, he was always one of them guys you knew you could count on. And you know, you know what he was doing. He was just putting time in. Owen had a teaching degree. Was planning in the next two years to go back to teaching. He says, Joe, I'm only doing this a couple of years. I just want to get my family financial set, pay for my house. I'm going to teach. Right. And and I and I'm all behind Martha right away, his wife, and and I hope I get asked to go up there to testify. So I sure will. Because be. uh, I talked to her lawyer, and and you know, and I, I you know, he told I had a conversation with Owen like that, and you know, and it was just her the one of the first sentences that came out of her mouth that she goes, I owe it to my husband that somebody will pay for this mistake, and retribution will be served. And that's what she said, man. So that's a bigger whoa. mistake. It's just a loss. Well, of how do you put a guy in a harness with no safety net? That's true. We are not acrobats. Even Sean did it at WrestleMania, I think twelve. I think it was. Well, yeah, it's too bad it wasn't but, Sean. But you know, it, there's there's no safety net. I mean, what do you, you try a new rigging technique that as soon as you pop it, it goes off. You're gone. That is just. Why do you try something brand new on a pay per view that night? Why I, why not even 
hook something that weighs a hundred and something pounds up at it first and lower them down. Why do it with the human? I know I did a test run once with him. He came down, he went up fine, you know, but something goofed up. 